hello welcome to my channel in this video by title you guys know that i will be guiding you guys how to apply to cgfns step by step on this page as you can see i'm going to go to cgfns international page and i just walk walk you through to these steps and um, i will try to explain you what are those are just stay with me and uh, thank you so much guys for liking and subscribing to my channel i hope you like this video okay so here you can select the state when you get to the cgfns page and here is select service by the by us state you have to select the state because every state has their different rules and policy and regulation you know every, every state is different so yeah you have to once you decide which state you want to be a nurse then you can choose the state um let's um and uh, let's see just go to colorado and let's choose colorado here you go and select a state all the state are listed down here you just click on colorado and you can see what are the requirements for the state state of colorado you need to have to complete the ccfns form so here is for the state registered uh, registered nurse initial license and endorsement and for the lpns especially for us who is already a nurse back in the country outside of the united states and you want to be here you go to initial license because the endorsement is for those who is already a nurse in the u.s or in a different state and you want to be endorsed to um you know to the another state is for the endorsement but uh, we have to choose as i said we have to choose registered nurse initial license uh, for the nclex once you click on it you can see here registered nurse initial license required is ces credential evaluation service professional report guys always remember you have to have professional report not the academic report in order to take nclex so once you choose is professional report is the main point to be remember you have to have professional report i'm repeating again so once you choose um when you, when you see the ces and you can go down here because since i said every state has different rules so the colorado need um english language proficiency exam which is ielts and toefl and you can see down here the scores which you need to have them you know some of these state like colorado you have to have exam score has to be submitted to ccfns um but um, some of these state they don't need um, TOEFL or IELTS score English um, language proficiency exam score results um, this is for the Colorado you can see the re um, requirement or the score how much you need to have it and uh, um, let's just say um, let's choose another state mm, 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 mm. As I said, since every board has their own different requirements, you can always go and you know check on the board or call them. Either also you can call CGFNS and make sure you submit all the documents and requirements what they needed to in order to complete the application. Um, this is the requirement. So uh, when you before you apply, you, of course you have to create your password and user ID once you click on the password and user id you have these options here so um, you have to log in as an applicant or the authorized personal agents because some of these state they have um you know company or agency they will help you with all your application process or you just have to give them consent or you know the author consent for the authorization for the access and everything because you have to give a social too or all the information you're re regarding your education so if you are just uh, if you are applying for yourself you just go to the uh, applicant and you log into the and you go and log into the system let's go to another state um for example let's go to new york board of nursing just go to new york and let's see what are their requirements once you click on the new york board of nursing you can see all the requirements and since you initial licensure 
for the NCLEX, you just click the initial license and you see here is unit CVS. Um, your board needs CVS and it say you do not need to submit your English score to the Board of Nursing or CZFNS. So you can go through that too. Um, yeah, as I showed you, once you logged in to CZFNS using your password and user ID, you have to complete all these forms. It's nine different sections. Uh, you have to provide your um, personal information, licensing information, education background, your nursing school background, um, um, everything, all these information you have to provide uh, to CCFNS. Please make sure you provide the accurate date and the information which, um, you know, which helps you to minimize the length of the application process to CCFNS because typically CCFNS takes um, a time. Once you complete to fill the, all the forms on the website, you have to click submit and have the payment done at the end of the application process. And it's not the end. You have to print all the forms from the website. Once you print all the forms, there is three different kind of forms. One. Once you completed all the forms, you have to print, as I said, in number one form, you have to send direct physical address to CGFNS. Number two, you have to send to your nursing school, and your nursing school has to send to physical address to CGFNS. And number three form is you have to send to your um, board of nursing where you received your um, nursing license, and they have to verify your license and send them to CGFNS. Uh, those are the three forms you all of them you have to have them signed and uh, your physical has to uh, your physical signature has to be present and send them to physical address to CGFNS. Um, I also linked the CGFNS address here but you can always find them from the Google and all the contact information in CGFNS. Um, if you guys have any other questions please drop me down below. Um, I will try to answer them and thank you thank you so so much for um, watching this video I hope this video is helpful for you I hope you find it helpful um, you guys good luck to everyone thank you for watching my video please don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel